So, if you've read any amount of light novels or manga online recently, you may have noticed that Manga Fox went down for a bit and now has a number of series that are completely unavailable. Bakasuki first got a large number of DMCAs for her series, and now their site is down at the time of this recording. And Skywood has had a number of their translations taken down too. This mainly seems to be because the Japanese publisher, Kadoika Shoten, has gone on a DMCA spree. In the case of Manga Fox, this is relatively unimportant because there's a lot of sites that host manga, so getting one crippled won't make that much of a difference. Bakasuki, though, is an entirely different case. It's the biggest site to host light novel translations, and losing it will mean losing most of the English translations for light novels that are available online. Even if Bakasuki does go back online just without Kadoaka's properties, it will have lost a huge amount of content since Kadoaka controls about 50% of the market share for light novels. This is a huge blow to the Western light novel community. Many of these novels haven't been translated into English and may never be. While Yen Press is doing a decent job bringing out official translations, they're slow and they only take a small fraction of the series that fan translators were working on. This will also make it a hell of a lot harder to grow the light novel community. I was first introduced to light novels through Bakasuki hosted translations, as I know is true for many people. Had I never come across their site, I don't think I ever would have thought about reading light novels, letting alone buying the amount that I have. I recognize that Kodoaka is well within their rights to have all these translations pulled, but I do have to question if this is in their best interest. Sure, the western market is small, but it does have potential to grow if fan sites don't get slopped down. Sites like Bakasuki help drive interest in light novels, and are actually really good about taking down fan translations when their official English translations released. Through this move, Kadoaka is essentially killing free advertising for their series. I just hope it doesn't end up killing the western light novel scene as well. If you're looking for other sites to read light novels, Nano Desu Translations seems to be fine at the moment and has about 25 series translated, and Sky the Wood has a couple of series that haven't been DMCA'd too. So, whatever else happens, I do intend to keep on reviewing light novels on this channel until all of them have got pulled from the internet. Thank you for listening. Hopefully next time I talk on this channel, it'll be about something more cheery. Cheers.